Are you tired of being overcharged and forced into paying a monthly subscription for your Mac and Windows software? Well, if you are, currently we're having a 50% off discount on all the latest Mac and Windows software, such as AutoCAD, SolidWorks, Photoshop, Microsoft Office, and much more. Our 50% off discount will be ending soon, so be sure to text us, Need Software, to 323-405-1341. That's 323-405-1341. We aim to please, so expect 24-7 technical support, the latest premium software, instant software links delivered to your email, and PayPal Buyer's Protection Guarantee. All right, Lord Jamar, what's going on with this Britney chick, man? Did you hear about her? Brittany Griner. What's her name? Brittany Reiner? Yeah, Brittany. I think Brittany. Brittany. Reiner. Reiner. Griner. Like grinding Griner. Oh, Griner. Okay. Um, Seven-time WNBA player of the year. Pled guilty to large-scale transportation of drugs. Two vape cartridges. And facing 10 years behind bars. Pled guilty. Mm, mm, mm. right so apparently she's claiming that she forgot it was in her luggage and she accidentally you know brought the shit to russia um even though i'm not sure you know she's probably like listen they ain't got no weed in russia i gotta make sure that you know what i mean like, mm. i'm not gonna bring no weed but let me bring some vapes cartridges like that seems like something safe almost like then i got they're not gonna know what this is and you know it's better than bringing real weed like you know what i mean that's probably the thought don't you process. think don't you think that also not only the thought process but it speaks to the arrogance of americans when it comes to international laws like everywhere's like America. Um, I don't think they're necessarily thinking that everything's like America. I think maybe they're thinking, you know, I'm American and I'm a little faster than these places. Like, you know what I mean? Like maybe these places are not up on certain shit, you know? Um, I think it more might be more of that type of mindset. Um, either way, I mean, I, right, she got caught with weed or whatever, you know, for 10 years, God damn, like that seems pretty harsh. Like, you know, <laughs> like, but you see what I'm saying, Lord Jamar, you see what I'm saying, man, that's pretty harsh according saying? to American standards. But in other I places, think that'd of be the world. harsh to, according to any standards, like, like, that's a harsh sentence, man. Like, for a little bit of weed. It's not like she was selling heroin to babies. Like, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> she, you know what I mean? <sighs> it's not like she molested anybody. You know what I mean? Like, she just got 10, she got 10 less years than Justine Maxwell, who fucking did all kinds of trafficking and all kinds of shit like that. She got half the time that she got. And all she had was two vape cartridges. She didn't hurt nobody. You know what I mean? But check it so, out, Lord Jamar. Let me check it out. I, I hear what you're saying, though, as far as I want to I want to I want to use of other I countries use another example. and all that type of shit. I want to use another example. For an example, what I mean is remember when those two chicks went somewhere to the Middle East and they got locked up? I don't even know if they're still locked up. But they were they were a lesbian lover and they didn't know that they couldn't hold hands and they went somewhere to another country in the Middle East and they got locked up. Do you remember that story? You remember no. that? No. So the gist is these two lesbians went somewhere to the um, you know, maybe I think it was either Dubai or one of those places, United Arab Emirates, and they got Hang locked on, up. Real quick. Thank you, Charlie. Appreciate you. How would Fubai respond to the biopic? Um, said he did leave you guys high and dry at one point. Listen, come on, man. Is then, this is now. Come um, on. Fubai's my man. If it was right, he would do it. Uh, that's that. Anyway, go ahead. So, so these ladies, they went to the Middle East, blah, blah, blah. And so yep. they got locked up for that. So what, what's your yep. point? What, what, 
How much well, that's time an example. did they get? That's How what much I time mean. did they get for it? For hold and they were holding hands. They was. The, let me see, man. Did they get killed. Everybody, I mean, people in the chats. I know you're familiar with this story. Let's what see. was the punishment? And I'm gonna say, you know, if it was anything worse than. A I guess the, the reason the reason why I brought that up is because anything to, anything worse than a week in jail for for holding hands heck against two women? No, man, it was man, it was harsh. Hold on, what was it? Up. Let me look it up. Hold on, <laughs> people in the chat, help me out, man. You know this story. Okay, so even if I don't agree with what they were doing, I could still tell you if the sentence was harsh or not, right, and and if it was. Yeah, that's their thing or whatever. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, that's I was using thing. that as an example of, I was using that as an example of the American mind state. Like that's okay here, so it should be. It's okay everywhere, and they travel abroad and they find out it's not like how it is in America. So you got to abide by their rules, and your ignorance is not going to be an excuse. Just because that lifestyle is okay in America you automatically think it's okay over there and then you get caught up. No, that's facts. That's yeah, facts. that's the point I was trying to make. So yeah, this and basketball that's, and that's shorty- happened with the weed too. No, that's Yeah, real. this basketball shorty, it's okay here in America, so it's probably okay and she got caught up. So that's what I meant by I feel like Americans have that arrogant mind state or mentality that because it's okay over here in the States, oh, well, it's got to be okay over there too. Then they go over there and they get caught up. So don't you now, think that it's arrogant? Now, now, don't you think that if all this shit going on with the Ukraine and all that, if that wasn't going on right now, don't you think it would have been a lot easier <clears throat> oh, to make like, yeah, you know, hey, 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 Boris, yeah, you know what absolutely. I mean? You know, why don't we just, you know, boom, 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 boom. You give me the, you know, basketball. I'm, mm -hmm. you know, and then we do it like that. You know what I mean? But right. because they, you know, all this bullshit going on, she's actually, you know, got to suffer because of that. You know what I mean? That that's that's some residual, you know, backfire, some some residual backblow from this whole Ukraine Russian shit. Right. Now, Definitely. when you need the relations for something like this to be good, they're not good. So now right. she pleads guilty, and so now what does that mean? Now she has to be sentenced, right? And right. so are they going to show her some sort of mercy, you know, to make themselves look like, see, we are not so bad nation. We do not just, you know what I mean, go so hard on people. We fucking, this girl, she was bad girl. She bring, she bring marijuana to my country, but still, <laughs> but still, I do not kill her. I do not throw her to gulag. I let her come home. Mm. You know, so do not look at Russia as bad place, no? Right. I can't, I, I cannot find it. Hey, Chad, help me find out how many how long those that lesbian couple got locked up over in the um tell me when the lesbian couple the united arab up. emirates that couple that went over there and they got they got hemmed up tell me how much time they get how much time the did they get are they still they might still be sitting sitting in jail i can't find it for holding hands yes it might have even been it might have been public displays of affection lord jamar whoa <laughs> oh. <sighs> oh, Knock it up. Boom, 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 boom. Hold on, Knock hold on. Up. Look at the chat. Look at the chat. They Knock said 25, boom, boom, boom. 25 years 25 for years. holding hands. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, that's pretty extreme. That's pretty extreme. But that also goes to show how much certain cultures have a disdain for that type of lifestyle that's all i'm saying but that's what so i'm you saying get 25 for holding hands but only 10 years for smoking weed but that's what i'm saying i feel lord jamar for holding hands as a same-sex couple 
and they're gonna and, and, and see and, and and it's these American motherfuckers that act like you see that's what makes that culture so barbaric. No. <laughs> Maybe that's what make him sensible. I'm telling you, you start going overseas, other parts of the world, you better research their culture and their laws and their and their mores, man. Don't get caught up. That's Everywhere facts. is not like America. Mama Stax is from Korea, yes? Oh, yes, sir. From Korea. I bet you can't go to Korea and do certain shit that you can do here. And you'll mm. mess around and get locked up. Do you know the ins and outs? What if you went there? Would you mess around and, and, and get yourself locked up on some not knowing? You just Hey, might. man. Hey, man. That's why you got to do your due diligence. I feel right. like as long as you don't do anything crazy, you know what I'm saying? Like, like. See, you don't really. You don't smoke. I don't smoke. Like, right. Yeah. So. But you still. But, you, you still might, you know. They now, might be, this oh, you cannot have more than three Cuban links. You right. are now going to jail. Well, I didn't I get know. Caught up. I, I didn't, didn't know, know, man. In America, you can wear mad Cubans. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I would get caught up. I, 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 I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know, man. I'm sorry. I'll yeah, take them no. all off. Because more than three Cubans looks like you're a drug dealer. And over here, if you even look like a drug dealer, you're going to jail. Mm. Huh? Huh? Did you know that? Did you know that? Hey, man. If you outshine Kim Jong-un. Right. <laughs> or Manny Pacquiao. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah, he's from somewhere else, right? No, no he's Philippines. Else. Talking okay, about the yeah, boxer. I'm, I'm mixing it up. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm, uh, I, <laughs> I'm mixing up my Asian communities. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, Street TV. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your um for your super chat. You said in 60 is 65 years in prison a fair sentence for Eric Holder, <laughs> the man convicted of killing Nipsey Hustle. Sentencing will be nine. 15 22 right two days before my birthday is that what he's in he can get 65 years is that what they're saying yeah he's facing life he's facing life mm -hmm. uh it's 65 years street tv wants to know is that a fair i suppose so i mean you know first of all you saying killing it's fake. someone you're saying the whole thing's fake first of all i'm saying that trials <laughs> put on tv are fake <laughs> The trial is this trial on TV? It's on TV, is it? You're right. Huh? Isn't this I don't know. Trial is on it TV? on TV? I That's seen what I want to know. I I've haven't watched clips. it on TV. I haven't watched it on TV. I just see little stills and stuff like that. Like that's is what it I'm on saying. TV? Where are these YouTube clips coming from? That's what I'm saying. Okay, I'm seeing, find I'm out. Seeing, I'm seeing YouTube clips and I'm wondering okay. where where is this coming from? Is it on television? Look it up. Google it. Let's see. Do your man. Googles. I'm gonna do my Googles, man. Um 65 years, yeah, for killing somebody. Sure, why not? You know what I mean? Why not? Um yeah, but he, he could he might get more than 65 years. Or is 65 years life for someone like him? How old is he? 30 something years old? If he's damn, if he's 30 years old and 65 years is a life sentence. They ain't gonna let him live to 90. They're gonna feed him that bullshit in jail. Yeah, for one murder, I think 65 years is, you know what I mean? Like, do motherfuckers have to have a string of murders? Somebody said for one murder only type of shit? Like, yeah. You ain't got to have a string of murders. Like, murder is not cool. <laughs> like, We can also reverse the question, He's man. 32 years old now. 
Yeah, murder is not cool. Um. So yeah, that's that's that sounds about right. But I know people that you know have committed murder and and have got less time than that. So there's that. You find anything, sir? I'm going to YouTube, man. I can't. It's just kind of confusing on Google. It has a bunch of uh, networks on there talking about it. Networks talking about it, right? But Yeah, but it doesn't mean it's on television. So I'm right. going to YouTube to see if I can find on YouTube. Are you serious? Did this? Is that true? What's that? I'm seeing something that says breaking news. Joe Biden is dead. Is that true? What? Because... I had predicted this a long time ago. Of what? Hold wow. Up. Hold up. Nah, I don't see that. Don't be fucking saying shit like that. Who said that, man? Somebody just said that in here, man. He's trolling. Yeah, that would have. That should be all over everything right now. But I see, I'm telling you, I see it coming. Like, I see it coming. They want homegirl to be the president. Yeah, that's fake. It's um, basically, this trial is basically televised, man. I'm seeing all 45 minute videos on YouTube, an hour. Oh, video. Yeah, I'm seeing 45 minute videos, one hour and 30 minute videos on YouTube. So, right. And they enlist lawyers like Chris Darden. Yeah, yeah. It's it's you know televised. I mean? It's televised. Like, yeah, so I stand by what I said about you know what I mean? Right. That's the trial. Now, does that mean the crime was fake? I didn't I don't know. I didn't say that. I'm saying that shit on trials on TV be fake. They could have already had a, a trial, you know what I mean? The real mm -hmm. trial somewhere okay. else. And this Who is for entertainment. And this is for yeah. I see what you're you saying. To watch. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Who knows if that's even if that's Eric Holder? <laughs> <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Like Look I know Joe phone, Biden man. is not dead. Joe Biden is not dead. Somebody put some dumb shit. I read some shit in the fucking chat, and that was a know. troll. Yeah, that was some troll. Now somebody did troll. get it right here. Now, now. He's he is brain dead. <laughs> oh man, he's brain dead. But uh, can you imagine if Kamala took over? Oh man, thank you. I am DJ Cool Rod. He said, Lord J, do a guest appearance on P Value, P Valley joke. <laughs> Let me give you, give you the laughy. Let me see if I could. Um... <laughs> I almost thought <laughs> you said I almost thought I thought I thought I almost thought that was you in the thumbnail in his picture. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um yeah, like I refuse to watch that show. I'm not fucking with it. I hope uh I mean I'm not trying to, you know. Come on, man. Lord Jamar, come on, let's stop saying the names of these other shows, man. I didn't say the name. Somebody just said the name. Oh, well, yeah, I guess I said it when I read his shit. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not trying to promote shit like that. Thank you, Sean O. Um, yeah, I don't fuck with that show. I don't fuck with that. I don't fuck with shows like that. Um, they trying to suck y'all in to some bullshit. I hope that real motherfuckers ain't <laughs> falling for it. There's certain shit that I just refuse to watch. And I don't care how popular it becomes in pop in pop culture. It don't matter. I, I never watched um, Empire. Never? 
I watched five minutes of it, like on the first episode, and it was the wrong five minutes. Like, I tried to give it a chance, and within that five minutes, niggas tried to start kissing each other and all this type of shit. So I'm not fucking with it. I'm not fucking with it. Like, so no, never. Not really. Um, I mean, yeah, I, like I said, I gave it five minutes, and after so that, never again. I'm uh. I'm binge watching Netflix. What are some good shows to binge watch, man? I, I, I'm finding it's hard for me to find shows on Netflix now for some reason. Um, for a lot of t for a long time, I was avoiding this that uh, English show, Top Boy. Oh, Top Boy. Okay, I've I seen heard that. good shit about it, but I don't. For some reason, I just. I don't know. I didn't want to. Name sounds it. weird, man. That name sounds. Yeah, sucks. I, I, you know, I started watching it though. It is pretty good. Um, it's pretty I feel good. Like, I feel like Netflix is falling off, man. Kinda. I mean, if you have you finished watching the Ozarks? Did you watch the Ozarks? Yeah, That's, yeah, I finished that. So the Ozarks. I ain't gonna lie to Stranger Things. I'm not necessarily into it like before. I don't know if I necessarily am there with it like that. You know what, Lord Jamar? I forget the name of it, man. Um, maybe people in the chat know. Watch this show on Netflix. It has to deal with a um a prison tower, a prison tower, and there's levels to it, right? And they put a tray of food. And the people at the top level of the tower gets to eat from the buffet of the tray and it goes down to the next level. And as it gets down to the bottom, the people at the bottom level have to eat the scraps of the people of the leftover. I want to find the name of that. I want you to watch it and give me your opinion on that. Hold up. Thank you, Charlie, for your uh, super chat. He said, did you guys see the Elvis movie? No, <laughs> oh, I didn't even know there was Charlie a must, movie. Charlie must be super new to the uh channel. Um, <laughs> did anybody here in the chat see the Elvis movie? And if you did, why the fuck would you do that? <laughs> like, what the fuck possessed you to go see the Elvis movie? Uh, like, like, why? Why? Why would you want to see that? Well, I didn't even know he had a movie. How many fucking movies are they going to make about Elvis? Okay. Kurt Russell did it in my goddamn generation. Um, oh, yeah, there's I found been quite a... a few movies on Elvis. I ain't trying to see the goddamn shit again. They locking up <laughs> R. Kelly. But they make movies about Elvis. A singing pedophile is a singing pedophile. God damn it. Well, because 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 R. Kelly's black, it makes him worse. This motherfucker is supposed to be the king of rock and roll and all that type of shit. Listen, I'm not interested in the movie. I found out that um, movie, uh, Lord Jamar. When you get a chance, watch it on Netflix. It's called The Platform. That's the name of it. Okay. The Platform. I want your opinion on that. He said he was the R. Kelly of his time. Godfather of Harlem. Somebody said to watch. I think I, I think I watched that at your crib when it first came out. Yeah, that's on Epics though. Uh, did, did they put the uh shit up on Netflix? Maybe. Flatbush Misdemeanor is a funny show. Yeah, it's all right. I heard Cobra it is Kai funny. Was it's just good. like a weird type of funny, huh? I heard Cobra Kai was pretty good, but I never got into watching it. Yeah, I like Cobra Kai. Uh, that's I watched that. Somebody said, Lord Jay, don't watch it. Shit nasty. Not sure which one you're talking about. Oh, you know what's back, though? What's that? That's a, one of the only saving graces for HBO is fucking um, Westworld. 
Westworld. Westworld. Michael I'm Wright. Watch tonight. I'm gonna watch that tonight, man. What's it about? What's the what's the premise? Or well, Westworld is, you know, they had like basically these realistic robots and created like a theme park but that that was so vast it was like a whole world like you know what i mean like okay. it was like a western theme world um with ai type of like humanoid um beings living in the shit you okay. know all right, I'm gonna watch at that some tonight. point, these cool. these things like recognize their own like existence and you know wanted more for themselves and wanted to get out of this you know of their box that they were in and now they're in a whole different environment like in a more futuristic time like <sighs> I seen a movie recently that was similar Did to you? that. Okay. It was an AI movie where the humans were trying to destroy the AI. Can't remember the name of it. Yeah, well, this is both. This is like the the AI now almost want to destroy the humans kind of shit for okay. for perceived damage that was done to them. You know. Anyway, 